Welcome back to the Daytime Kitchen. We got Delta Blues Barbecue from downtown Bristol. Here we got Rachel and Travis with us. And you got that meatloaf going. We're going to take right. a look at that maybe here okay. in a little bit. Right. But we're going to do smoked bacon bourbon pecan pie. Did I get it right? Yes, you got it. Uh oh, <laughs> it's a mouthful, and it's a mouthful I'm looking forward to. <laughs> yes, yes. Tell us how you get started, Rachel. All right, so you're going to start with just three eggs. Okay. Just, you know. Just beat them up. Beat them up. There you go. <laughs> exactly. Um, then you've got about a cup of sugar. All right. I like how this is going yes, so far. Yes, there you go. Pour that in there. Okay. It's going to make, uh, this is going to be the sweetness of it. Yes. This is going to be your sweet mixture. Uh, about a half a cup of light corn syrup. Okay. We well, this is going to be sweet. Yes, this is yeah. this is the important part right here. All right. All right. You get that mixed up, get that going. Okay. All right. Now you add about three tablespoons of melted butter. Oh, yeah. Right. Paula Dean would be proud. Oh, yes, she would. <laughs> yes, she would. Butter makes it better. There you go. All right. You'll add just a pinch of salt. All just right. a little bit. Yeah. Just kind of get a little savory yeah. in there. Yeah. All right. Vanilla. About a tablespoon. A little vanilla goes a long way. Yes, it does. It <laughs> really does. You got to be careful. All right. And then the bourbon. This is very important. And, and talk about this. Uh, this is a bourbon right there from Bristol. Yes. It's uh, it's from um, Lost State Distilling. Right. So we like to support local, keep it local as much as we can. Uh, any good bourbon will work. Any good quality bourbon. All right. So we'll just. And they've got good quality bourbon. Oh, yes. So there we go. Yes. Oh, All man. right. So now we got our mixture already. Okay. Just mix it till it's smooth. All right. All right. Then you've got some pecans, just some pecan halves. Put them in the bottom of uh, your pie crust. Okay. All right. Some crumbled up bacon. Same thing. Very just kind of make a layer on the bottom. Yeah. All right. And then you're just going to give little that all a bath. Yep. And then you'll just <laughs> pour it all over it. Yep. All right. Exactly. And Travis, your dessert, you know, everybody wants to come there for barbecue, and that's great. That's what you're there for. You got those desserts because sometimes you just got to have something sweet at the end of a meal. That's right. Yep. Yes. Exactly, you're exactly right. <laughs> and again, this is our spin on a classic. So yes. that, the whole smoked part in that. And then you're going to top it off with more uh -huh. pecans. Uh huh. So you'll do the more pecans. Just kind of make another layer on the top and another layer of bacon. And you're oh. ready to put it on the smoker. Oh, yeah. For that's the key here. Uh huh. Right. We're not yes. putting that in an oven. You were going to put that in a smoker up there. Yep. And it comes out looking just like this. Yes. Exactly uh -huh. right. Uh -huh. yep. You got that meatloaf you can show I us? I do, yes. All I right. can pull that out real quick. We've got, uh, we got a few seconds left here. Okay. Let's take a look at that that beautiful meatloaf. He just stuck it in, this, in the oven just to warm it up a little bit. It had been smoked. Look at this. This is a thing of beauty right here. Oh, my right. goodness. Mm -hmm. Oh, and you say you have this on a special from time to we time. We do, time to time, yes. Right. We'll run it as a spe uh, yeah, special. All right, Delta Blues Barbecue right there in downtown Bristol. Thank you all so much for being here. Hey, thank, thank you for you. having us. Oh, man, got to get up there. They got that great deck area out on the back there. You go out there and eat and just enjoy the evening airs. It is Delta Blues Barbecue located right there on State Street in downtown Bristol.